All right, we are back playing New World. And where's this next guy at for my quest? Right in front of me. There we go. I figured out how to turn your volume off. All right, what are we doing now? Hearth and home. Rewards. Our bustling settlement is quite a welcoming place, and you may wish to return here as you explore the far reaches of the territory. Some moments you may want to take in sight, but others you may wish a speedy return. This is where Inkeep Bit Biton comes in. He's a friendly man with a room for anyone in need here in Monarch's Bluff. Chat with him at the end. He'll help you find your way if you wish to return here with haste. There's another great amenity you want to take advantage of. Uh, by public degree, all visitors to the settlement have access to our storage sheds to keep safe spoils of their adventures. Ooh, try them both, and you'll soon see how much you'll come to rely on them. Except, well, I think I found something equivalent to a bank for this mission right here. I believe so. He was saying it was public storage. So I wouldn't think it would be like open public storage. Well, where could it be? Oh. Oh, that was a long fall. Check my map. The second building. It's to my left. This place right here. Alright, it's by the crafting stations. Um. Oh, you have to select one of the options. The blue or the green flag. One's magic and one's health, usually. I think I looked at this house. Yeah, this is the triple layer. It's got two fireplaces. I'm good. Check with innkeeper bid time for vacancies. Innkeeper bid time. Oh, right here. E set recall point. Would you like to check in? This will allow you to recall, respawn at the settlement from anywhere in the world. Yes. Interact. Oh, it seems you already checked in. in. You go. Okay. Open a storage shed. What's next? Alright, so that's cool. It's like the ends where you recall that. Or if you die, it's where you come back. Hey, 
Hey, bum. Get up. There's no sleep in the streets. Cannot damage players in Sanctuary. Um, you can use your emotes. Or you can just... Well, you don't have a keyboard, do you? Or you can type it in with your keyboard. Forge slash K-N-E-E-L. Social, yep. Oh, barkeep. I think I want to be in here. Oh, storage shed right here. It looks like a storage shed. These are my stuff in here. I can keep up to a thousand. Oh, that is going to be great. Oh, I like y'all in the shed. It splits it up for you, like apparel, ammo, hammer. I can get rid of. I'll keep my tools. Oh, that's awesome. Resources. Did you just do <laughs> I don't know what you did. Oh. Okay, I'm looking at the map, and there's a storage shed. Outfitting, loom, kitchen. Another storage shed over there. I wonder if they're linked. Let's take a look. Question is, how do I get over there? Did you uh, figure it out? But I just figured out. Hold down the middle mouse button. Tech, tech here. Need help. And it puts a thing on the map. Need help. A little marker. I don't know how to get rid of it, though. Right ahead should be another storage shed. We're going to see if they're linked. And I heard them. Right. Storage sheds are linked for this city. Don't know if they go to any other city. What I heard was, let's, let's do a test, is that you can craft directly from the storage shed and you don't have to have the stuff on you. 
We've got to test that. We're about to go chop some trees. And I leave out the doorway where there's no trees. Chopping it down. Two trees should be enough for my test. It is, it's nine something here. Let's go to bed. Got about another hour, then I'm headed to bed. Here's the test. Wood shop. Tier two. Look at that. Speaking of look at that. Character woodworking. Tier six, forty seven to level seven. Okay, it did give me some levels. Level seven. Awesome. I like that right there. Yeah, you don't have to grab this and grab that. Worry about being overweighted. And you shift left click and it just deposits it all. Oh, I still haven't turned in this quest. Nope, you don't have to carry it from one station to the next. That is awesome. Like that a whole lot. Have you given the inn a look over? It's got the coziness of home without the high price tag of actual land ownership. If you're tired of sleeping in whatever is available room there is and demand a space more private, you may eventually wish to buy a home and fulfill those lofty dreams. The storage also helps in daily tasks as well. There'll be many times when you look to lighten your pocket without selling yourself out of house and home. Though your space in the storage shed will be limited and goods you store in one territory won't be available in another. This island is supernatural, but sometimes a shed is just a plain shed. And we're going to complete. Alright, so like Black Desert Online, stuff stored in this town will not be stored in another town. So you're going to have multiple storages, like you can do all your woodworking in this one, and your armor crafting another which makes it kind of nice but you know gives you more storage at least because that's what I did in Black Desert I did different things in different cities so I could store different stuff all right what we got here newcomers and mocks bluff
Um, oh, we got this one. Oh, no, I don't. Earn 5% more faction tokens while at March Bus. What is that? Gain. Let's do XP gain. Love it. Oh, for your, uh, your Kokobu? Oh, that was level 20. Oh, yeah. The ones you can just pay to take you from city to city. I never actually used them. Alright, so for the rest of the episode, I'm just going to be grinding some trees and killing some wolves, so it's not going to be too exciting if y'all just want to head on out, and we'll start us another quest tomorrow. We're going to do one quest a day, like Final Fantasy, and then I'll do other stuff, you know, crafting and gathering after I do the quest. So time for me to grind a little bit. I don't even know what they need in the other clan. That's okay. So you ready to buy this yet? So you ready to play for a week? 40 bucks? It's an expensive hobby. Logins up almost up to level twenty. Oh, someone's about to declare war on this place already. Yeah. <laughs> Syndicate has thrown Mark's blood into a conflict state. They can now declare war. do it I should have all my gathering clothes shouldn't I but they're in the locker oh well If I can roll now that my uh, my weight is lighter. Nope. Probably uh, if I was to take off this armor. That didn't do it. What about these? Let's just take off everything. Be naked as a tree bird. Find a wolf to attack. Oh, something new. Orange fungus. Somebody one shot at that dog. I can't roll no more. Oh, 
Oh, he one shot at a turkey. It wasn't a wolf. He had me fooled. Yeah, I can't roll anymore. Why not? Is it because I got the bow on? I have no clue why I can't. Maybe my game is glitched and I need to reset. Equip load is now on. Oh, you got me. I'm just gonna keep harvesting. When I gathered bushes, does, did that give me gathering for bushes? Can't remember. Yeah. I don't remember. I have to find one and see. right hand side where the quest is if you click on the not the quest itself but the objective it'll show you where it's at It's pretty good about giving you quest objectives in that game. My game is lagging or something. It was like I was blocking and he was still swinging. That's all right. We're going back out again. Gosh, all these people recruiting for clans. <laughs> Anything ain't coming out for another year. We're look, yeah, looking to develop. It's 
done. It is finished. That is strange. You sure they're on a different level, perhaps? Ooh, this stone weighs a lot. Mm -hmm. I'm about to go fight some more wolves, get me another level. I think they're right over here. Yeah, that's where my death spawn is. Cranberries. I'll take them. You've been picking the wrong stuff. Is B not working tomorrow? Hmm? Is B not working tomorrow? Um, he is working tomorrow. He said he's on his way to bed. Do you know what time is it? He, he told me what time it was about 29 minutes ago. He said something about he needs to go to bed. But then he said he wants to see me beat up this big boulder right here. So I said, okay. I'll beat up this big There's boulder. There's a wolf coming. I ain't scared of no wolf. Okay. Keep beating him. I am full. Still got half a plate left here. Will that try because he's blinding? Uh-huh. He said he still don't see his. Where's his at? Right here. Left over. Are you trying to hold me down? Get on your pillow. Yeah, I think that's too long for her. It's a trip game! Baby. Why are you so aggressive? Because this wolf wasn't eating him, so I was going to eat him. Run you. And steal it like I do. Steal it. Bam. Nah, -uh. look at me grab that circuit right now. Got him. Got them feathers. Snapped it. Yep. And now Snaggletooth Wolf is going down. Snaggletooth. Yep. Like old dog Snaggletooth. Yep. Just like our doll. And you're doing an all nighter? Six days straight. Okay. A six day marathon. Okay. Didn't I tell you that? <laughs> Pat me on the head. I hope you got your bike ready to go in the morning. Because I can't take you to work, so I'm on my hair style. Honey? Huh? What day is tomorrow? Um, I don't know. But you said you're working tomorrow. I'm not working. That's what you told the lady on the street. 
Hey, that's what you told Judy. You said you was working tomorrow. I don't know. I just know what you told people. So, if you were lying to people, they're going to remember that. Buzzy, come here, little boy. Come here, little Buzzy. 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 There you go. Get on that, on that nice little pillow of yours. All right, so Susie, in this game, you got a storage shed, which is like your personal locker. When you put stuff in it, you can go to the crafting station and it automatically pulls from it. Like I've been S saying, plus. that needs happen in other games. S plus? Yeah, kind of like S plus. Isn't that so nice? Oh, I need to cut a tree now. Use my sword on the tree. All right. 